This is the Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is the Chateau Model C977 Disc Padlock. This is a relatively standard looking stainless steel disc padlock with one major exception, and that is the inclusion of a 7-pin tubular core. Now some of you who have been with me for a while may recall that I featured another Chateau disc padlock in video number 378. That was the model C970, and it looks very similar to the 977 with one exception, that being the use of a six pin standard pin tumbler lock as opposed to the seven pin tubular core. We're gonna see what it takes to pick into the 977. I will say that before starting this video, I tried using a tubular lock impressioning tool, actually quite a few of these tools, to open this up with no lock. This is apparently a non-standard keyway. My 7.8 millimeter is a little bit on the large size for it, and I moved down to the 7.5 millimeter, and it's a little bit too small. So if nothing else, it provides some protection from impressioning insofar as most of the standard tools will not work in it. That leaves us with single pin picking, and that is what we're gonna try right now. Gonna put some tension on that core, and then take this broken pick and use it to push the pins down. What I do when I'm picking these locks is go around in a clockwise motion. There's nothing magical about the direction. And press on each pin. If it's loose, I leave it alone. If it's binding, I push it down till it sets and keep going around until, until the core turns. One is loose, so is two, so is three, four, five, maybe got a little something out of six, little click out of seven, click out of one, nothing on two, click out of three, nothing on four, five, Click out of six, nothing on seven, nothing on one, two, three, four is our binder. Okay, we picked it one position, and it's probably not open quite enough to take it off of whatever hasp it's locked on. So let's pick it one more position. And of course, when we pick it this time, we only have six pins to deal with because the seventh is in the 12 o'clock position where there's no driver pin underneath it. Okay, click out of one, nothing on two, click on three, maybe something out of four, nothing on five, click out of six, one feels set, nothing on two, three, four, okay, five is binding. Okay, we got it open one more position, and that's probably enough to take it off of whatever it's locked on. So, even though this is not a terribly technically challenging lock to pick, it will take some time to open up. If for no other reason, then you do have to pick it two positions. So, all in all, not a bad little lock. Certainly well-constructed stainless steel 70 millimeter lock, no complaints on the construction. And as far as the pick resistance goes, it will take you a few minutes to open up, which is probably better than most comparable locks. So that's all I have for you on the Chateau Model C977. If you do have any questions or comments about it, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe, and as always, have a nice day. Thank you.